This is a cue. A regular solid with 24 right angles, 12 sharp edges, 8 corners, and 6 faces. This cube could be anything. It could be a box full of items you ordered online, a case filled with your collectibles, or maybe a fridge stuffed with your favorite food. Sometimes it's an office or a house. While a cube can be all of the above and more, here at ICANT, the Institute for Creativity, Arts and Technology, we've created a different kind of cube. One that can be anything you want it to be. It's a space where you can make anything happen, starting simply with an idea. Our cube is a five-story state-of-the-art facility that can easily turn into an immersive experience. A studio for motion capture. Or an exhibition space. It brings to life all of your technological and creative ideas in one unique setting. The hybrid black box theater and research laboratory is equipped with systems for spatial audio, motion capture, virtual reality, and much more. The cube also features the Cyclorama, a massive cylindrical projection screen for immersive experiences. At roughly 40 feet in diameter and 16 feet tall, the Cyclorama can accommodate up to 60 people. Within it, the projection fills your entire field of vision from anywhere you stand. Meet Taisha and Gustavo, two people very familiar with the cube. Taisha is a scholar. Disagreements that the cliques have with one another. She needed a place and a space for her Afrofuturism to Vibranium and Beyond course, as well as numerous other projects. Okay, I love it. Mm -hmm. So this is ABC? Uh. Oh. When Virginia Tech hired me, I was given a tour of the Cube and other ICAT spaces. And while finishing the tour, I was inspired to host my intellectual mixtape project in the Cube. The intellectual mixtape is a module in my Afrofuturism to Vibranium and Beyond course. Because of its conversational nature, it required a public engagement component to add a layer of creative collaboration between my students. The Cube's multi-channel nature was crucial in amplifying the impact of the module. And to this day, I have used it nine times for the Intellectual Mixtape Project, once to teach an immersive virtual environment's winter course, and several times as the co-artistic director of CubeFest. None of my projects would have been as successful as they were without the Cube. This space is so inspiring that when I'm there, I can't help but think creatively. Let's give a warm welcome to Digging in the Crowds. Gustavo oversees the production of over 90% of the projects utilizing the cube. In 2013, I came to Virginia Tech as a candidate for a position with the Moss Art Center. And if you guess I visited the cube, you were right. After joining the Moss Art Center that year, I used the cube for the first time, but it wasn't to work on any personal project. Today, my role has completely shifted. I work for ICAT and I play several roles at the Cube. I schedule researchers, artists who wish to use the space, and I advise them on lighting, event production, and theatrical system usage. Simply put, I manage and supervise projects in the Cube. The types of projects that go into the Cube vary considerably. The first time we try something new, it's often challenging, but those challenges allow us to create new tools that we can use in the future. If you wonder how difficult it is to use the Cube, don't worry, it's relatively easy depending on what you use the space for. What a great place to try something new, creative, and collaborative. What, uh, could you tell me what is your IP address? 
We welcome wild ideas that make every day in the cube very different. Using the cube for your projects is so simple and straightforward that iCount makes many things effortless to let you focus on being the creative person you are. At iCount, we foster a culture of creative collaboration. So don't wait any longer to make your imagination come to life. Start creating and building your projects using the cube. We are expecting you. And if you still have nothing to make in the cube, then join us in person and online to enjoy the projects we host regularly. It's all free. Our cube is very special, but the only person missing is you.